Welcome to whiskey.com where fine spirits meet. My name is Lüning, Horst Lüning, I'm the master taster of whiskey.com and today we commence our series of peated single malt whiskies from the Ben Riach distillery and today we have the Ben Riach 25 years Authenticus here on my cask. It's 46% ABV, unchill filtered, uncolored and it's it's a dark whiskey, 25 years and there is probably a sherry cask mixed in this limited whiskey. Um, I said a lot about the Benria distillery in my introduction to the Benria distillery and this one is the 25 years old which follows the 21 years old which is sold out in the moment and I showed the miniature um, in this introduction video. Um, well, and I don't know uh, how long the 25-year-old will stay. And uh, please be aware that there are two 25-year-old single malt whiskies at Ben Riach. One is the unpeated. It has a more or less gray box, bigger, thicker, uh, no wider. Uh, and it's filled, I think, with a higher ABV, 50% ABV. Yes, I think so. The 25 and the 30 years old. And this is the peated called Authenticus, Latin word or sounds like Latin. And this is the peated version. So don't mix both up. Um, mm -hmm. um, what's said in here? Yes. Inside are tasting notes. <clears throat> um, appearance bright warm amber gold yes definitely dark amber gold nose elegant aromas of ripe pineapple fresh mountain herbs and a profusion of sweet peat a huge pungent blast of wood smoke emerges partnering the peated element perfectly full-bodied and audacious I never heard that word I have to look it up Plate, a fantastic fusion of rich peat and smoldering embers bound together by fresh herbs, oregano, anise seed and chicory in particular. A rush of sweet wild honey provides a lovely contrast to this lovely intense expression. Chicory. It's a salad. It's this bitter salad. I don't like it, but I eat it. This bitterness in a salad is, is weird for me. Conclusions. Terrific weight and development which leaves a powerful, long-lasting impression on the plate. Sounds good? Tastes better. Uh, some people say, why are those uh, boxes bent inwards on the left-hand side? Well, the cask is becoming drier and drier and the the ends are bending in, so they, they, uh, the boxes fell in. And uh, I have a wide angle lenses uh, on my camera, and this is also a distortion of the wide angle lens as well. So don't be afraid, they won't fa <coughs> fall down, fall over. <coughs> so here we go with the Authenticus. Very little smoke in here. Very interesting smoke, yes, combined with some vanilla sweetness and caramel in the, in the beginning. Yeah. And the smoke is not that medicinal, but more bonfire. And there's some fruit, some exotic fruit, yes. And mountain herbs, of course. Mountain herbs, valley herbs. No, I can't figure out which one and which herbs grow on the mountains. In Scotland, perhaps heather, yeah. Sweet 
and the peat smoke, of course. Vanilla and caramel, together with a sweetness. Pineapple, probably, don't know. Have a sip. Mm. Oh. Herbs and sweetness, mouth-watering, and in the back, yes, some chicory, yes, definitely, A faint bitterness. Yes, but if you ever said to me, it's a dark chocolate bitterness, I would say probably yes. <laughs> Those herbs will bring the difference, yes. And it's going over cooler any seed. And this tells me there might be some cherry casks, European wood in the, uh, in the batch because those cask bring this anise seed aromas and wild honey probably yes sweetness not honey no smokiness the aftertaste is not too long perhaps after the second sip mm. This is one of them, very, very good. It might be quite expensive, I don't know. Don't spill a drop, no. I don't, can't tell you how expensive this is. I think about 200 euros, $250 probably. But I think it's worth the money. It's well matured. Good sherry cask influence. The smokiness has, well, transformed itself into more complex aromas. It's not this frontal intense pungent peat, no. It's more pleasant, it's sweeter, uh, and it's more oxidized. Well, wonderful on your tongue. Thank you for watching whiskey.com. There's more to come. Feel free to share this video, you know, and look up in our database. Probably there are some tasting notes already for the Benriac 25 years old in there.